It's been great. You know, um, I think that, you know, I think it was Jackie Robinson who said, a life only matters in the effect it has on others. Sure. You know, because of that, you know, I consider myself an activist first. You know, acting is, is just a lens uh, to who I am. It's a, it's a form of expression. It's a platform that I can use to, to go into a community of bloods and say, look, what you're doing is a better way. Sure. You know, um, you know, people don't read as much as they should anymore, especially young people. You know, in this explosion of uh, social media, uh, everything is at your fingertips. You know, pe to sit down with a book, you know, to read Dickens or you no know, one's going to do that. So I feel like film is 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 the new medium of of literacy. Sure. You know, so that being said, we have a responsibility. You have responsibility as a journalist. I have responsibility as an actor. You know what I mean? As a filmmaker, um, to to produce projects or to put things on screen that will, will, will kind of um, perpetuate a truth, uh, the right kind of truth, sure. that will motivate and uh, affect the, the trajectory of our young people. I'm so extremely careful to a fault. Right. Um, it, it takes a certain level of living inside of your means to be able to have discretion in film. Uh, you know, your, your first time you make you know, 100 grand in a film, you say, you know, some people, oh, I'm going to buy a car, I'm going to put down payment on a house, and now you're invested, yeah. which means the next film has to be equal to or more, and the next yeah. one after that, equal to or more, and the next one, equal to or more, yeah. um, which takes you out of the running for a lot of independent films. Uh, a lot of opportunities fall by the wayside because you have to support this habit of consuming. Sure. Um, but I feel like I've been very blessed just to have a mother that taught me, look, don't live outside of your means. You know, you, you have your legacy, uh, you have your line in the sand, you have your sacrifices, uh, and, and understand that they're all connected. And, uh, and I, will n I would never put myself in a position where I had sacrificed the legacy of the platform that I'm trying to create sure. because I wanted a sportier car. You know, um, <laughs> but it's a hard lesson learned. A lot of people kind of fall in that trap. So I live, you know, well inside of my means um, so I can and make the films that I want to make. I feel like, you know, I've had the opportunity to not only work with people that are icons, but work with icons that were willing to share. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I had an opportunity to work with Denzel Washington. He said, you know, you know, a, a, an artist's career is dictated in their first five jobs, you know, which is a daunting statement. Uh, because your first five jobs, a lot of times you're like, I just want to work. What can I do? Hey, put me in. Put me in. Please help. Look what I do. Look what I look like. Am I doing right? Um, but it's so much more than that. You know, I think that if you can have discretion, especially in the beginning, yeah. then you've created a persona that people will accept. You know, if when they look at you, they oh, that's the guy that's done these three movies that I, I like for these reasons, you know what? And directors have that same idea, you know what? I like him for this movie because these last couple movies he's done. Sure. But it's a rough road. You know, this is my ninth year as an actor. You know, and I've, in nine years, I think I've done maybe, I don't know, 11, 12 films. Sure. You know, which is a low average in terms of you know, how many films is he doing? One point, one, three or something. Yeah. Um, where some of my friends, you know, they do five movies a year, but their career's in decline. You know, I did Red Tails that came out this year, and uh, Red Hook Summer with the Spike film, and uh, then Arbitrage. Uh, and then I'm starting a Liam Neeson film. It's called Nonstop next month uh, with Julianne Moore. Um, this is where I want to be. You know, I want to make films that inspire and that encourage, that are responsible, you know?